Okay, Seth, so uh, last night, uh, guy pushed you a little bit, gets a takedown at the end. Didn't look like you are holding anything back tonight. Pure domination. Uh, get a quick fall for you. You were not on the mat for the whole match. Uh, how good did that feel, first off, to, to get out there and get some back points and then yeah. get the fall? Yeah, it felt good. You know, I've just been getting on the fat mat this first competition in a while, so it was good just break, getting that rust off and getting a little better each time out there. So that's kind of been the focus is continue to get better. And, um, you know, I needed to make some minor adjustments as far as my top wrestling I was doing some bad habits out there the last three, four, five matches and just making minor adjust adjustments to get back to what I used to be doing to these guys. So that's kind of been my focus here is just continue to get better and get better and uh, keep dominating guys on top. And, uh, yeah, I gave up. Just trying to go for the major yesterday. Kind of gave up a late takedown. But it is what it is. You know, can't, can't dwell on it. Got to get better. Keep moving forward. Low singles. You're low single at everyone, man. Yeah. Like, I've been watching you the last two weekends, and I'm like, this guy, he's low singling everyone. Yeah. Your attacks are up. Yeah. What's, what has been going into the attacks? Just and you're, We know you're great on the mat. Everybody knows that, right? Yeah, yeah. And, I mean, it's it's great to be great on the mat. But once I get to freestyle, it's, I, you know, I can't count on that. i got to keep developing on my feet. And that's been the big thing for me is just keep getting more and more things that I can use on my feet, find different ways to score on my feet. And that's been a big focus for me. And uh, upcoming this next weekend, i got to be got to be uh, just, just ready to go on my feet. Got to make sure everything's touched up and ready to go there. And, Got to get my offense going. You know, it's it's going to be a huge weekend, and um, yeah, excited for it. Brookings is not Madison. Madison is not Brookings. A huge difference, okay. right? Yeah, like right. we're talking probably about one of the greatest college towns in yeah. America, and I don't even think it's really questioned. Yeah. Madison, Wisconsin is it's it's an amazing place, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, what has this transition been like for you? Whether it's school, whether it's culture, whether it's I mean the weather's even a little warmer in Madison, right? Yeah, well, what's we have, what's it been like as far as culture change yeah. and, and the town and everything? Yeah, it's been amazing, and uh, yeah, every everything from school. You know, I'm one of the best business schools in the country the campus is as beautiful it get as it gets a couple lakes surrounding it and uh, you got the all sorts of just really cool stuff around campus uh, and then then the culture you know being back with bone on region and really focusing on developing that championship culture it's just that's been our focus all preseason we preach championship culture doing every single thing right you know not just insider wrestling doing things right as far as school doing things right you know your social life everything's got to be right if you want to build that championship culture and uh that's been big for us and just creating relationships with the guys you know i came in here and and they took me in as, as one of them and it's been great just just being able to be a part of this brotherhood okay so i watched you walk out on the mat last week against fresno state i'm like this dude's massive at 33 okay <laughs> then that, you know then people have been talking for a couple weeks about you going to feral 57 you're standing in front of me you're massive right <laughs> so 57 you know i was i was comparing you to nick simmons yeah. right the east lansing strangler yeah. um not quite as similar on top with the the, the yeah. pain right yeah. but but you're going to be a threat at 57 kilos you're going to be a big problem for people, yeah. right and i think that's obviously the goal right when you look at 57 kilos what's what's the mentality going into that and, and obviously keeping the weight low yeah. right and, and going into feral and trying to obviously win the tournament yeah yeah and i mean i've been having to be more disciplined than i've ever been in my life as far as nutrition i've been walking around at no more than 37 38 keeping it there and yeah it's gonna be you know just be this week is huge you know every it's my last decent meal right here and i gotta get get, get perfect from here on out but yeah going into 57 is exciting man i get an opportunity to wrestle a lot of guys that you know i didn't get to wrestle last year in the national season and uh it's just another opportunity, and I want to, you know, show that. Yeah, I have goals. My goal is to be an Olympic champion. I want to show that, you know, I'm right there with these guys, and you know, just continue every time I step out there, just continue to give the glory to God out there, and uh, just do the best I possibly can. How about the, the depth of 57 kilos in America? Yeah, it's like in adding you to it is just like a whole yeah. other layer. Oh yeah, man. It's, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna it, be fun. It's fun. Sure. Scared? Do we know who's at the Feral yet? Have they have they done the entrance? I've heard a lot of different names thrown out there. I think guys, entrance wise, Tomasello, Cruz, maybe Suriano, and rumors of Lee going there. So they I mean, hey, it's gonna be one way or another. It's gonna be a fun tourney and. Uh, yeah, I'm, ex I'm, I'm excited. I'm pumped too, man. Yeah, all right, it's be all fun. right. There's a little more calzone D. You got anything else? You don't have any on your face. You're good. All right, all right thanks. <laughs> you got anything else for me? Ah, uh, jump around. Jump around. Thanks yep. for the time. Congratulations yeah, thank on the big you. win Appreciate tonight. It.